Mastering Gender Neutral Language, an empowering tool for English learners. Hello, language enthusiasts. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into an incredibly important and evolving aspect of the English language, gender neutral language. We're going to explore some online resources and tools that can help you master this essential skill, paving your way towards fluent, inclusive, and respectful communication. So, what is gender neutral language? Well, it's a way of speaking and writing that avoids bias towards a particular sex or social gender. In English, this usually means avoiding gender specific job titles or pronouns, especially when the person's gender is unknown, irrelevant, or non binary. Gender neutral language helps us to communicate more inclusively and respectfully with all people, regardless of their gender identity. It's a key part of modern, respectful, and inclusive English. If you're ever unsure about whether a word is gendered, online dictionaries are great places to start. Many now provide guidance on gender-neutral alternatives to common words. Instead of chairman, for example, you might find chair or chairperson as gender-neutral options. A quick search can ensure you're using gender-neutral vocabulary whenever possible. One of the best ways to get comfortable with gender-neutral language is by integrating it into your everyday writing. Several online writing tools and plugins, like Grammarly or Hemingway Editor, can help by flagging gender-specific language and suggesting more inclusive alternatives. Remember, practice makes perfect and using these tools can help you become more natural with gender-neutral English. Joining online communities that focus on gender-neutral language can be immensely beneficial. Forums such as Reddit and Quora have many threads dedicated to gender-neutral language where you can ask questions, share resources, and learn from others' experiences. It's a great way to learn interactively and get real-time feedback from fellow language learners and native speakers. That's all for today. We hope you found these resources helpful for your journey into gender-neutral language. Remember, language is always evolving, and as English speakers and learners, we play a part in shaping it. By using gender-neutral language, we're promoting a more inclusive and respectful way of communicating. As always, keep practicing, stay curious, and happy learning. Until next time, language lovers.